Welcome to 3 Minute Thoughts. So today I am in Fremont with the Fremont Troll. Quick correction, the footage is not from today. This was actually shot all the way back in June. I only shot about a minute worth of footage on site and I didn't really know what to do with it. And then I realized, you know, I could just use this green screen, which I've only used once so far. And ta-da, that's what I'm doing. It's an iconic figure in Fremont, I believe it was built in the 1990s, commissioned by the Fremont Art Council. Fremont Art Council is also the people who put on the Summer Solstice Parade and the Winter Festival. They did help out with a lot of art projects within Fremont. Hey, go figure, the name actually matches what they do. It's cement uh, that is actually a life-sized VW bug in its hand. Well, it's not a, a sculpture of a life-sized VW, so this thing is fairly huge. Here's something I was surprised to find out. The VW Bug actually is a real VW Bug. It's not a sculpture of one. And it originally had a time capsule inside and a bust of Elvis Presley, but they were stolen by some vandals. It's been in a few movies. It is under the Aurora Bridge. You may hear traffic, another iconic bridge in Seattle. Trolls are known from Scandinavian folklore for living under bridges. Well, that's what Wikipedia says. I just remember trolls being in Scandinavian folklore as creatures that didn't like the dark because the sunlight turned them to stone. But I believe the Three Billy Goats Gruff might be a Scandinavian story. So yeah, there's a trolls under bridges situation. This originally though was built because this is a hangout for drug dealers and the Fremont Art Council wanted to kind of dissuade them from being in the area. So they built this sculpture. I'm not really sure that is very much of a way of dissuading people but if there's a lot of tourists there then maybe it is it's a good starting point for, for lots of events trolloween is a halloween themed i think march that starts here or zombie marches start here shakespeare not just yeah shakespeare and the troll in july they'll have various plays on it and it's found at the end of troll avenue someone suggested i should use the green screen and put my eyes and mouth for the troll, and then I could actually interview the troll, which might be kind of funny, but at the same time, I probably wouldn't use a, I'd actually use the video, the screen screen for the whole thing. Uh, let's see if I could try this. I am the troll. Anyway, yeah, I could interview the troll and like maybe interview various landmarks in Seattle, which could be a little funny, but that feels like a lot more work than I really want to put into these videos, which I already put, do put a lot of work into. So I thought it'd be interesting to check out like various landmarks around Seattle, and this is the first one that came to mind. So if there's any other landmarks that you want to have some that you think would be kind of cool to check out and see, hit me in the comments. Anyway, those are my thoughts. Thanks.